All right, top of the middle of the day to you boys and girls. We're gonna do a little saw testing today. We're gonna be running an Insanawise 390 XP. This saw has a modified combustion chamber. It's headed down to Roseburg. And um, actually we're testing two saws from the same gentleman. And we're gonna have to do a bar change in this operation. So we're gonna have a little bit of time to talk a little bit more about what's going on. So meanwhile, I'd like to thank my youngest son Jackson for helping with the cinematography today so here you go bud Come in a little closer, bud. All right, so like I said earlier, we're doing a little saw off with the 390 with the cut combustion chamber. Keep in mind that these, both these saws are fresh out of the shop. So we're still getting the carburation dialed in. Take a look at the screens, bud. You don't have to get so close. Anyway, they're still running pretty dark. You can hear when I was backing off of it a little bit how it's blubbering at high idle which is good for the break-in period right kind of curious to see how this thing compares against the uh, 395 since the 395 is kind of a beast right right Let's put this down out of the way too. Now by rights there shouldn't be too much of a comparison even though the little saw has a modified combustion chamber and it pulls really good I noticed. I'm well pleased about the hop up job on it. But I guess we'll see here.
Thanks, bud. All right, now we noticed that this saw pulls pretty good, but it's missing pretty good at high idle as well. Insanoized 395. This thing is kind of a beast. Long bar saw. I think we're going to be running a 42 on it when he gets it. And this would be helping him butcher this guy's last name. I tried it in an earlier video, uh, Mr. Mitzkus. Um, so, anyway, thanks for um, watching today. Have a blessed day wherever you might be on God's green earth.